Patrick Evans. Out of the classic club, our view almost obscured by the rising sun. Pretty morning out there and our temperatures as cool as we've seen in the morning hours just about all week long. Uh, mostly sunny skies now as that sun comes up. It is a pretty start to our Wednesday, our hump day. We're going to get over the hump with comfortable conditions by comparison. Still going to be warm out there. Remember, the average high for the date, 107 degrees. We're going to be close to that, still slightly above it. High pressure has retreated a bit. It's off to western Texas, uh, eastern New Mexico. And what will happen over the next couple of days, it will return moving back toward the west coast. When that happens, our numbers will start to rise again. Uh, as this area of high pressure sets up shop almost immediately adjacent to us over Arizona. And that will pull in some heat and keep us fairly toasty. Some of the hottest temperatures we've seen, in, in fact, likely the hottest number we've seen all year. 74 right now, though, uh, and 73 in Palm Desert, 72,000 palms. We're down at the lower 60s at thermal, so we've cooled off nicely at the east end of the valley. Widespread this morning, though, from the 60s to the low 80s. Light breezes across the Coachella Valley. Our relative humidity is running in the 20s and 30s. The atmosphere is fairly dry. You're going to find some exceptions to that, but the dew points will go down steeply as we head into the afternoon. Very dry air mass uh, moving in for the day and for the next couple of days. So the evaporative cooler should hum right along for you. We'll top out close to 108 degrees this afternoon. That's within a degree or so of our seasonal average and below 110, which is pretty important this time of year. Uh, that's really the line of demarcation for us. Uh, as we look at the Comfort Air 7-day forecast, the numbers start to come back up. By Friday, we're at 111, and then we have an excessive heat watch for the weekend as temperatures get close to 118 degrees. It is going to be extremely hot over the weekend, dangerously so, and it's something we'll need to pay very close attention to. Jeff and Angela.